Former President Donald Trump's remarks about former Congresswoman Liz Cheney getting a lot of attention, and now they're under investigation by Arizona's Attorney General. Former President Donald Trump. She's a radical war hawk. In Glendale. Let's put her with a rifle standing there with nine barrels shooting at her, okay? Let's see how she feels about it. You know, when the guns are trained on her face. The Harris campaign saying that's a reference to a nine-gun firing squad. But the Trump campaign and Arizona's GOP chair saying that takes Trump's remarks out of context. He was talking about uh, people that consistently vote to enter into military engagements that don't have personal skin in the game. Arizona GOP chair Gina Swoboda says voters don't care about this controversy. Others see it differently. Uh, that's just language that shouldn't be accepted by either party. And I'm glad that uh, to see so many people speaking out. Former ambassador and Arizona Senator Jeff Flake is a Republican backing Vice President Kamala Harris. There are debates to be had on this subject, uh, but using language like that isn't the way to do it. He points to other things Trump has said about Cheney. He previously called for Liz Cheney to uh, be called before a military tribunal. And Cheney responding on social media saying, quote, this is how dictators destroy free nations. They threaten those who speak against them with death. Arizona Attorney General Chris Mays' office confirming that she's looking into whether Trump's remarks violate Arizona law. I think that's the most ridiculous thing I've ever heard, and I would hope that the Attorney General of the state of Arizona would get to work protecting our people from the fentanyl that's killing them, from the, the crimes that are rampaging around the state, and stop trying to get involved in, in political garbage. Flake calls Trump's remarks inappropriate, but not criminal, and says voters should ask themselves if they want four more years of Trump. I think we want to turn the page and move on to more civil debate. For ABC 15's political team, I'm Manuelita Beck.